What's up everybody, I'm John. I'm Isaac. And on today's episode of Cars and Cameras, the 900cc Ducati powered go-kart is back. We are installing a new shorter chain. We're gonna look into installing some off-road tires to do some off-road hooning. Why is that, John? Because there's not enough pavement in the world, sir. I agree. <laughs> Before we make these mods to the Ducati, let's take a minute to talk about today's sponsor, the Neighbors app by Ring. If you're anything like us, you have a lot of possessions that you care about, whether it's go-karts, mini bikes, flatheads or tractors, odds are you wanna keep the items you've worked hard for secure. The Neighbors app by Ring is a powerful community-based tool built to keep your neighborhood and possessions safe, and it's completely free. With the Neighbors app, you receive real-time crime and safety updates from the community. It's like having a neighborhood watch right on your phone. Let's open the app, go to map view, select safety alerts and suspicious activities to see what my local community is talking about this week. First off, all posts and comments are monitored 24 seven by Ring's in-house team and are 100% spam and troll free. So you know what you're seeing is legitimate. A lot of neighbors are reporting gunshots recently. Other users are able to post, comment and share information with one another to provide more substantial evidence to authorities to crack down on criminal activity and make the neighborhood safer. The bottom line is, if you see something suspicious, the Neighbors app makes it easy to inform the community. Millions of people are already using it. So if you wanna see what's going on in your neighborhood, download the Neighbors app today. Go to ring.com slash crosscarts to download from the Apple or Android app stores. That's ring.com slash crosscarts. Make your neighborhood safer today with the Neighbors app by Ring. So in the last video on this car, we re-geared it. The problem we ran into when we re-geared it, it caused the chain to be too long, m making the adjustment maxed out, which put too much stress on it and it failed. So we are putting a half link in with a brand new chain. This is a non-O-ring chain because we couldn't find a half link for an O-ring chain. So we had to go with a non-O-ring chain. So don't hate on us. It's just what we had to do. So let's get that adjuster bent back into place and we'll cut a new chain for it. So we hit a pretty major snag. The half link that we special ordered does not seem to fit a 520 master link. It, it, the holes seem to be just a little bit too small for 520 chain. So the options are move the engine, which that is honestly not an option. That would be an all day thing. Yeah. Move the axle back, which again, isn't really an option or re-gear it again. So that's what we're looking at. Fourteen teeth. Fourteen. So we're gonna run around to Ike's work, see if we can't find another engine sprocket, something that'll work better, because that'll be way faster and easier than changing the axle sprocket. So we were able to find a 15 tooth sprocket for the engine. Fingers crossed, hopefully it'll work. Ah! Oh. Here we go. Is our button going bad? Or is the battery just not good? My eardrums are bleeding right now. I gotta tell you, man, this this thing's like just the most awesome cart. I'm not gonna say that we've ever built, but one of the most awesome that we've ever built. Yeah, dude. So the Ducati is back, seems to be running as well as it always has. So we're almost ready for a rip, but first we're gonna toss on these 
racing wheels with the special order turf tires from GoPowerSports.com. Don't mind the vice grips, guys. <laughs> Nothing to see here. Wham! That looks cool! Yeah, it jacked it up a lot, dude. I'm into it. I know you are. It Rally does. cart. I really like those chrome wheels, a lot, or the polished aluminum wheels a lot better than those black ones. All right, I gotta say, the new wheels and tires look amazing. So we're gonna load this thing up onto a trailer, take it out to our favorite test spot. Our only test spot. Yeah. <laughs> Give her a rip. Go have some fun. Holy cow. That is a trench, folks. is 30 feet away and I'm getting showered. Ooh, it's a wild Are you kidding? <laughs> oh my god! Buddy, I need you to stop before you kill yourself. You look like a rag doll. I feel like when it. When you were spinning around, you could tell you had no control <laughs> at all. Thirty point nine five. All right, that's a wrap on Ducati no, gets turf tires. No brakes. Really? Yeah. That was a thirty-one seconds. Um. Yeah. No. Oh gosh. No oh, wonder. Ha ha ha! That's very important. Dude, I hit the brakes over there. There was no brakes. Yeah. So I go drifting, and you know how fast I was going. Oh yeah, you're cooking, dude. That was a scary ride, and I stalled it over there. I had to recrank it. Oh, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I could have done it in 20. I believe you. <laughs> you all right? Yeah. You look like you got to work out. Yeah, you want to try it? And you've also... Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I really do. I think it picked up the front wheels over there when I spun it. Really? Yeah. Holy... I think it... Cow. Yeah. Dude. Oh, man, I showered the house in mud, I'm sure. No, you showered everything, dude. Holy cow, man. Ducardi, bro. Ducardi. <laughs> She's a beast. What a wild ride. Ike looks like an absolute ragdoll on there. But it is actually a lot of fun to ride. You can feel every single power stroke just, like, beating you in the back all over your body. Yep. 
it's just, I don't know, it's a wild ride. It's a good old time. We just wish we had more space to really open it up. But even then, dude, you were doing donuts, and you were saying how you were. it felt like it, it was going to pull the front wheels. No, it felt like it did pull the front wheels. So, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I got dirt everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> right now, I'm satisfied with the way it is. Let us know. What do you guys think? Keep it on the Ducati the way it is or build a chassis for it? I hope they say leave it the way it is. <laughs> I, th I think it ought to be uh, left the way it is. This thing was on TV. That's right. Uh, just the way it is. So, I mean, uh, well, with different tires on it, of course. But yeah. I think we ought to leave it alone. It's my thought. We can always find other engines that are awesome. Very true. And put on other frames. Very true. If you enjoyed today's video, please give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to Cars and Cameras for future updates on the Ducati. Uh, sneak peeks on what we're up to. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram at Cars and Cameras Reviews. Check me out at Isaac. It'll be fine. Support the channel by picking up a t-shirt at cars-cameras.com. Thank you for watching. Oh, of course, we can't forget. Visit GoPowerSports.com for all your go-kart and mini bike needs. At checkout, be sure to enter their monthly in-store credit giveaway and let them know that Cars and Cameras sent you. Anyway, thank you for watching again. We will see you next time.